Checking with Jay Crawford and tonight's helicopter highlights. Jay? Well, Mike, as always, the helicopter takes in two football games on this Friday night. For the first one, we went to Licking County. Let's get to the highlights. It had Utica taking on 2-0 Heath. So let's get out to the action. The Bulldogs are ready to go in this football game. Already 3-0 in the second. Watch Jeff Betts, the quarterback. He's going to cut back the other way. 19 yards for the touchdown. 10-0 Heath. Betts threw for one and ran for one. Still in the second. And now watch, let's watch Betts throw the ball. Nathan Schaefer, 46 yards on the reception, down to the 10, and that set up this touchdown, and of course, Schaefer gets to do the honors. 10 yards, he had two touchdowns, and it's 3-0 for Heath. They win big, 38-0. All right, our next stop will be Northridge, 2-0, or 0-2 Northridge, rather, hosting 2-0 Millersport, 8-0 in the third when Jeff Bodenot goes 51 yards for Northridge, and 0-2 Northridge is up 14-0. Now 14-7. Mid this is could have been the tying score, but it's a fumble. Number 57 picks up the football. His name is Josh Good. And he looked pretty good on that run. 65 yards into the end zone. 22-7. Northridge beats previously undefeated Millersport. Mike, back to you. Hey, thanks. Uh, back in town, a rivalry in the southwest. It's Grove City and Franklin Heights. We're going to pick up the action with an end zone view. The Greyhounds on the move. Derek Combs sweeps the left side, and the sophomore goes in. This is a huge score because Grove City wins it by one, 21 to 20, Don. All right, Mike, out east. Bexley hosting Whitehall. Third quarter, Bexley up 21-14, but here comes Whitehall's Murad Holiday. 63 yards for the touchdown, and we're tied at 21. Holiday, 311 yards tonight, three touchdowns. This guy can do it all. Then we'll come back with the game winner, Rams. Jamie Mason with the touchdown.